The International Committee of the Red Cross, ICRC, is training over 150 journalists in Nigeria and safety tips for dealing with life-threatening conditions during their daily assignments. The organization, which operates in 100 countries, is focusing on the North East and providing humanitarian support to those affected by armed conflicts. The training will include basic knowledge and first aid application to support journalists during coverage of events in Abuja. Daniel Edobo further explains the benefits of the training and why it is necessary to everyone. Fully that uh, conflict reporters pass through a lot of uh, uh, challenges that have to do with getting injured, sometimes getting killed. There are so many platforms where you see journalists, uh, the number of journalists that are killed within a year. So we deemed it very necessary to give our own support in this regard, to be able to train journalists on phase eight so that uh, they would be able to take care of themselves and take care of their colleagues in, in the field. Uh, in the course of operations, if something happens, and they are injured or uh, need some free hospital support to go to the hospital. It's important that we all learn first aid. The fact is that the fact that first aid saves lives cannot be overemphasized. Um, we need to learn these skills, not just journalists, every household needs to learn first aid because sometimes, at some point in our daily work, at some point in our lives, we need first aid either to save our loved ones or our colleagues or ourselves. And the skill we have learned as a takeaway for the participants, we want them to teach their colleagues and families because it may just be them that have the knowledge that may be a casualty or a victim so that they'll just be able to assist them. Participants of the training commended the facilitators for the positive impact the training has added to their knowledge. It's a very, very nice training for me personally because I've benefited a lot. Before now, I've not been exposed or have the knowledge of uh, all that was taught. But after the training, I think I'm very good at uh, what we're taught. We learn a lot of things. We learn on how to uh, 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 place people in recovery position. The participant, everybody I meet, was very nice and uh, jovial. We were just like a family, and as a team, we have a joyful training so far so good i think nothing was so bad and cpr i learned how to place people in covid position i learned what to do to stop a bleeding bonds scars and lots more and i was issued a certificate at the end of it all it was it was an amazing experience i'm so glad to be a part of it hello Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.